good y'all welcome back to another video of toronto huskies franchise i don't know why i'm talking so fast <laughs> so we're going to face the colts in the game of the year probably if not close to game of the year on this, on this channel if not this series alone um we're dealing with a couple of injuries tom Montgomery has a broken thumb so that stopped him from playing great it's up five weeks Mark baron domino's here he comes back next week Prince Amukamara, out for 16 weeks. That, that's how long time. McCaffrey comes back next week. So, a lot of people, or two people, come back next week. A lot of key pieces on our team injured. Still got to come out here and play. We are facing the 5 and 6 Broncos. I had to sign a running back. Just for just, just for one more game. Um, I like how we're playing. Let's get right into this game against the Broncos. They are a... I'm guessing low 80s 82 to our 86 a lot of teams we face are in that 82 range four hundred touchdown three passing touchdowns that's the one thing i'm not using my coach xp at all they have joey bosa okay defense looks promising so far let's see who this team has if i can recognize anybody I like so far I'm not recognizing any faces. I feel like I should know who that is, but I just don't. So Broncos are in the hunt. We are one of our division leaders. We are tied with the best record with the nine and two Browns. They're in the hunt with a lot of teams. I literally didn't notice anybody on their team. That looks like Case Keenum a little bit. But then again I just can't tell. I don't know. And their quarterback is indeed Case Keenum. I was right. I was definitely right. I thought it said Allen for a second. Like, oh, wait a second. Didn't we just face this guy? Got traded already. So I would suspect a run here. And uh, I was wrong to suspect that. Interception on the first play. That's the case, Keenan Mine, though. Uh, last week, our offense played fairly well. I'll say that. Um, except for the end where he threw a fumble. That was fucking bad. Like, that, that's no need to be said. That was, that was a very unexpected fumble. And if we don't get that fumble, we... Possibly win the game. Just run. Good little 13 yard gain. I think I'm going to keep passing the ball here as I run the wrong play. So I'm just going to run. Good little five yards, seven, eight, maybe. This team has been showing a lot of blitzes. Like, what is wrong with y'all with these blitzes? Good. We also moved a couple receivers up um, in the lineup. So you're going to see a lot of Marquise Brown and... DK Metcalf. You're going to see a lot more of those guys. And this is where our team's going to be hurting at running back for well, this, la this last game. We're actually going to be seeing it like this. Uh, we have no power back, so in situations like right here where we possibly could be getting an easy score by just running it in, we won't. That's an easy touchdown for Kyler Murray. Yeah, we just won't because the power back, we have none. Good rush. Uh, that puts us up early. Seven minutes up. So first play, we sent pressure at them, resorting in a pick, which was great. Unexpected, but great. Uh, this play, we're going to send pressure again. See what that does to them. And see if we could... Get a result in the same turnover. Nope, we get a sack. 
Aaron Donald and Josh Allen coming up with the sack on that. Wasn't that a beauty? As I kind of, I still expect him to run here. Yeah, they definitely do, but we do seek it out. That's about it. Give me that. Why would he throw that right at me? Possible pick six. I tried to dive, and we still get it in. Ooh. Is that Nasir Adderley? No, that's not. That's Marcus Williams. Or Marquise Williams. One of them. Still good. Still good. We're playing well. This is not a great team. Uh, offensively, they don't seem great. You have Case Keenum at quarterback. You have a bunch of decent receivers that really don't complement each other like that. The best receiver you have on your team is Juju Smith. Best, as you receiver receiver you have, yeah, it is Juju Smith. We're going to send pressure again because <laughs> pressure works so well for us. Wow. It's like I wanted to cover that, but I didn't want to throw it to my man. So I'm like, I'm just going to stay on mine. I've been running way too many coach suggestions this game. Like, I think I'm going to have to run my own offense. I mean, defense at some point. As they go to the flat. Who's their running back? Tampa 2, we're going to run. Their running back is... Robert Kelly, I think. That's just a funny name. Wow, okay, that's me. I take blame on that. I tried to hit him. Okay, that puts the lead 14 to 7. Going up a dumb touchdown. Something that we shouldn't have gave up, to be honest. John Ross. Some big yards on that outside run. Four yards, 51 yards. Looking good today. Them blocks picked up well when I really did not think they would. Beautiful pass. Uh, only if you could have got away from that. Offensively, we are looking untouchable. Like, I want to try to get a run, but... I guess I'm going to just try one run. See what it does. Doesn't look too good, but... We actually get in. There we go. Their defense doesn't look that... Like, it's really... They're sending a lot of blitzes. Like, that's what's really messing them up, especially in a passing game. Because we have a quarterback that just could just work his way out the pocket and create more time for receivers to get it open. It doesn't really benefit them a lot. Do we have a bad kicker? Is, like, is the wind just against us? Because like, our kicks are going short every time. Okay, so I end up checking the team's um, defensive players. Not that good. Not going to lie. Like their cornerback, not that good. Like, and I swear to you, they're not. Like... They go deep. Oh, my God. He could have caught that. I feel like that's the third time they ran that exact play. Horrible throw. Case Keenum not really getting it done today. Block. Don't really have anything. What a catch. Marquise Brown, I believe. Okay, they're stacking. I'm still going to run. As we find a hole. That's why I still chose to run. Good first down. Probably going to run here.
That should be a touchdown. I mean, I guess I'm on one. That's kind of whatever. Touchdown. Marquise Brown, I believe. Might be his first receiving touchdown of the year. That puts us up early 28 to 7. Dominating halfway through this second quarter. There you go, short. Get a decent amount of yards on that. Wow, what a fake. I'll give it to them on that. That was a good one. Another intel. This signed by um Patrick Robinson. Good run. I didn't feel like I could stay in the pocket too much longer. And I couldn't get to the outside quick enough to extend the play, so. Gonna try another outside run. It's gonna be a little bit harder. A uh, good little five yard gain. I believe that was about five on that. Good. Uh, what a play by Travis. We're making these smart decisions. Not really taking too many deep shots. And if we do take a deep shot, we know we definitely can make the pass. Touchdown. I Ow, I thought I stepped out. Oh my God, it's about to be so bad. And that, Kyler Murray breaks Russell Wilson's. 2012 touchdown record. I don't know what it was, like 22 or something like that. I don't know. I don't know how many touchdowns Colin Murray has. He might have stepped out. I'm not going to lie. We look at that. He might have. I'll review that. I guess not. Oh, well. They, they, they care not to. That's 35 to 0. Really dominating offensively and defensively. I think um, Case Keenum has threw... Three picks, one touchdown, not that many yards completed. I I think this change of defense and inserting new people in my offense has made the team play better. They go short. They're going to hurry up here. We're going to send pressure at them. That's a good spot. That's me. Once again, playing two up, trying to come down too quick. So they possibly could get points here. I am going to send pressure. And it worked. Josh Norman with the sack. Oh my god. Why would you do that? Almost came away with a sack there. And an intro. You could tell the pressure we're sending at them is making them very uncomfortable. They go out of bounds. Caught it out. That's not good. Come on, he caught it out. Let's not try to debate. They gave him... See, I really gave him two yards. Do they really need that? And they're going to call timeout. And they're going to kick their field goal. You guys are going to put them 
put him up. <laughs> That's gonna give him a 10 points. 10 to our 35. You know they wanted 7. You know they wanted 7. They gave us a flag. Interesting. I just wanted to run the ball and, like, get out of here. A 60. They want us to hit a 63 yard. Can we actually hit that? Whoa. I think we can. If we hit this. Whoa. He hit a 63 yarder. Who is this kicker? Um, I'm going to play one more drive on offense, one more drive on defense, and then that is it. Especially if they don't score on defense, I'm, I'm not going to do anything. Oh, what a throw. Catch it. <laughs> oh, my God. They just did not cover that deep route. They did not cover it. Secondary routes, they just did not do it. Beautiful pass. That pass a little wobbly in the air. And Ty Lockett gets the touchdown. What a throw. See, that's what happens when you send pressure in and pressure does not get in fast enough. 45 to 10. I'm giving them one chance on... Um, on offense or defense, depending on which way you see, you, you know what I mean. Case Keenum not playing too well, like at all. He is not playing well at all. That's me. I'm not gonna lie. That is definitely me. I stopped playing because I felt like he was gonna get pressure and he was gonna get sacks. So I'm like, okay. Let them just sack him. Let them do their thing. They know what they're doing better than I do. They tried to go deep, which was, it was smart, it was smart. I, I thought they was going to run it, that's why. I got blocked badly. Did he get that? He's short. We're, we're sending pressure at you, bro. Oh my god, I can't get where I want to. They actually do score, so... We're playing more football. Uh, a couple mistakes on defense by us, not gonna lie. Horrible mistakes. Some, some things we shouldn't have done. Missed a couple assignments. That is 45. Two seventeen. Couldn't get a throw off. So that's actually gonna be our first punt. And that's this first half of this game. Right now, not so much. We get the sack. We get the fumble recovery. What good stuff on that. Case Keenum not looking too good. He always shows, like, yeah, he completes a pass and then something good happens. And then things like that just happen right back to him. Trying to get in. And that was actually the backup running back that we just signed recently. Try to get a quick pass and touchdown on this because we are going to be blitzing very hard and we get it. So I think that's kind of all we had to do on this game. It is 51 to um, 17, so we got to stop. We scored on defense and we scored on offense and they do end up scoring. So it's going to be a final foot 51 to 20. Very dominating. Please tell me Kyler Murray did not 
throw an interception. I almost said Kyle Lockett because I'm so tired of Lockett. <laughs> adding Marquise Brown in our offense, finally. I know it's a little late in the season to be doing that. But adding him in our offense makes our offense very deadly. He threw the ball for 272 yards, four touchdowns, one interception. So mad he let the interception happen. How did he let that interception happen? It wasn't even me. It was in the sim, obviously. Uh, Case Keenum threw the ball for 253 yards, two touchdowns, three picks. He was absolutely horrible, even though he had 200 plus yards. Uh, John Ross, wow, he rushed the ball a lot. He was really good. He rushed the ball for 129 yards and touchdown. Nobody else really rushed the ball really good. Juju Smith caught the ball seven yards for 106 yards and one touchdown. Tala caught the ball two times, 101 yards and one touchdown. Marquise Brown caught the ball five times, 66 yards and one touchdown. Rest was kind of spread out evenly on both sides of the ball. Very convincing performance by our team. Letting some other teams know that we may be a bunch of rookies on one team, but we're ready. As we, we most likely will be in the playoffs. Uh, next week, we'll be facing the Falcons. The two players, Mark Barron returns with injury and Christian McCaffrey. We love that. We absolutely do. Yeah, we will be facing the 9-3 Falcons. We are 10-2. and two. Do it for us. Uh, like the video if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. Watch one of these videos you see on the screen. And I will see you in the next video. But until next video, peace.